At this stage in the production, I'm checking the output of every amplifier on every uh, output setting 4 ohm, 8 ohm, 16 ohm. And I'm testing the stability of the power tubes, of the power section of the amplifier, by knocking on it. So um, uh, this is the, the last and third sound test and um, basically what we do is check the, the cabinet and the speaker for resonance, uh, buzzes and noise and that kind of stuff and of course check all the tube microphonics which is very important and all the functions on the amp, uh, whether they are still working now that the amp is mounted in the cabinet. It's all good, so we can uh, wrap it up and pack it in. So while I'm doing this, I'm checking the amp on uh, the panels on scratches and the vinyl on damages, um, which I hope there aren't any because in that case the amp would have to go back to to be repaired or whatever. But it has to be all tight. So. Funny details that we use we use this stuff because it smells good when you unpack the <laughs> the amplifier. All the knobs on zero. Make sure the power and the standby switches are turned off. Don't forget the manual, of course. And 
the last thing we do, which is very important, is we um, uh, we do that through all the, uh, the production line. Is we file all the serial numbers, so we can, if, uh, if needed, we can track down uh, when an amp is made and uh, who made it. Besides that, we take care, great care in design and production, we also take great care of our customers itself. The after sales, the emails that come in, we try to answer them within a week. Uh, and of course, uh, the warranty issues, we try to handle them as fast as we can, sometimes by sending uh, the spare parts, sometimes by giving advice. And of course, we train our distributors and dealers to give the customer the best uh, care possible.